Hello everybody and welcome back to MLB The Show 16. Welcome back to Diamond Dynasty. Today we are doing another Battle Royale draft. You guys liked the first one so much with the all-around players. Why not give it a second chance? Today we're bringing out the muscle. We are bringing the power draft. All things power contact. Don't even think about it. If you guys like this video and you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And all you other ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching the video. Like, comment, share, you guys know the drill. Let's go ahead and let's get into a Battle Royale 1500 Stub Center. We have 1530, so here we go guys. Remember, power is the key. And I think we just found our first guy. 95, Yoannis Cespedes, even though that Nolan Ryan looks pretty good. And if it is a pitcher round, it comes down to two pitchers. Then we'll go with whoever the best overall pitcher is. But for round one, we are taking Yoannis Cespedes. So we get a 99 diamond. Next up, it looks like it is going to be a uh, third baseman. And Rob Sedigin... Sagadin, I don't know how you say that, but that's who we're going with. Round 3 of 25, it is going to be... This one's really close. We might actually take a pitcher here. I think we're going to do that. We're going to take Garrett Richards because we need a starter. And, all right, here we go, guys. Posey, unfortunately, he's contact Jacob DeGrom. Not going to get it done. Looks like 87 McCutcheon. Is going to be the man. Or actually, that's not right. Dante Bichetti, or Bichette, for the Rockies. He's going to overpower McCutcheon. So we'll take 85 Dante Bichetti. And right now our team is very, very stacked. This one, probably going to go with uh, Stephen Lee. Don't know why, but I think we're going to go with him. Because of uh, all that power. So 91 Stephen Lee. We're getting a very, very good draft right now, guys. But, unfortunately, it is only bronzes and silvers left. So, you know, you get what you get. But here we go, guys. We're going to take Byung-Ho Park. I don't know if that's how you say it, but we're going to take him. Onto the bench now, or pitcher. We are going to take, uh... Well, unfortunately, we're going to take Jace Peterson. Because, why not? Round 8 of 25, we are going to take same scenario. We're going to take Jake Elmore. John Ryan Murphy would be good, but a little bit more power on Jake Elmore. Never heard of the guy, but hey, don't judge a book by its cover. Right here, Hank Conjure will be our pick. And right now, we have a 78 overall team. We need to improve, and here's where it's going to get better with some nice silver pitchers. So... Remember, pitchers were taking the highest overall, and we will take a Tom Wilhelmson. That's a very nice pick there, and remember, it's overall, so whatever happens, happens. Right here, we are going to get ourselves a John Axe for 2011 rookie year, I believe. I think that's what that means, throwback rookie year. I don't know the difference, but throwback rookie year, John Axe for round 12. We're nearing in halfway, or we're about halfway. We're going to have to take between Sean Tolson and Blake Snell. We're going to take uh, I'm gonna take Blake Snell. Needs starting pitching badly right now. And uh, unfortunately, Garrett Richards hopefully is in our highest. Right here, if they're tied in overall like this, and they don't have a live or uh, inside edge little performer or upgrade or downgrade, we would take whoever we want, but since Koji Uara has that plus four, or he's playing like an 87 instead of an 83, we're going to take the highest one there. So Koji Uara will be in our bullpen. Our bullpen's looking very nice right now. Round 14, highest rated is going to go Tyler Matzik. So we do upgrade there. We're still in the mid-70s though. And uh, can we break that 80 barrier? That's what we're looking for here. Round 15, it's going to have to be uh, Chris Capuano. And that dog is absolutely going nuts outside. Apologies for that. 
So, last starting pitcher or reliever in the bullpen. Unfortunately, we're going to have to take R.A. Dickey because why not? R.A. Right, Dickey and his knuckleball, yeah, it's, it, it's not really good, but unfortunately, we're going to have to take him. Corey Neville playing like an 86 will overpower Liam Hendricks, so Corey Neville will be in our bullpen. Again, very, very, very solid bullpen. That's what you need in Battle Royale, three inning games, though. So, right here, around 18 of 25. We're going to have to go with a Vinny Pastano right here. I know the other guy's playing like an 84, but base Vinny Pastano, Pistano overpowered him by one. Round 19 of 25, six rounds left. And we are going to go ahead and take David Hernandez from the Phillies. We still have that 79 overall team. Right now, our power is nothing. 63, our contact, nothing. Speed, n tied with power. Right now, besides pitching, defense is the key. So, very defensive draft, trying to get power. That's how it works sometimes. So, round 20 of 25, we are going to go ahead and take our guy right here, Aradis Vizcano. Never heard of him either, but there's our bullpen. And now our bench players. This is where it gets good. Three silvers, two bronzes. First one up, we are going to go ahead and take power hitters once again, guys. We're back on that. And overall consistency power, it's going to have to be Hanley Ramirez. Playing like an 84, that will obviously change, but it will take Hanley Ramirez. Next one up, it looks like it is going to be close. But we are going to take Colby Rasmus over Nick Castellanos. So 81 there. This bench will definitely, definitely improve us. So hopefully, you know, we get some good guys. Round 23 to 25. Three rounds left. We're going to go ahead and I take Jose Abreu. I mean, why wouldn't you? Javier Baez is very close. And actually, David Ortiz... Rookie year in that Minnesota uni. He's got more power than Abreu and actually a little tiny bit more power versus lefty. So we're going to take David Ortiz. Might use him as a farewell card. 79 overall though. Rookie year. Can't really get mad at that. Around 24 of 25. We are going to go have to take Johnny Peralta here. 79 overall. We have 67 power. Still now defensive. And power tied. Final round here, guys. We are going to go have to go with Orion Rua. No idea who that is. But we get an 80 overall team. So, ladies and gentlemen, that was the power draft. My name has been James, or JT Plays on YouTube. Thank you for watching. Once again, if you're new, subscribe. And if you've been watching the videos, be sure to like, comment, or share them. I'll see you guys.